Hey guys, it's Nicole, and sorry for the way I look right now. I kind of uh, tried to get presentable a little bit for this video, but I haven't done anything all day. Been really depressed and kind of mopey all day. So, um, yeah, and also sorry about the bed frame in the back. Uh, we're putting together my bed frame. So this is Vlogtober Day 15, and um, I would show you guys a bunch of video clips of my family and introduce you to everybody, but um, I live in Idaho, and my whole entire family lives in Nevada. I'll just tell you guys a little bit about my family, like my brothers and sisters and stuff like that. So my oldest sister, Mandy, is 32, and um, she was a teen mom at 16. She got pregnant at 15 and had her daughter at 16. And um, she was pregnant with my niece at the same time that my mom was pregnant with me and Maggie. So my niece is only six months younger than me and Maggie. And she's actually in one of my videos um, when I went to visit Nevada then she popped up in the background when I was taking my 20 week update. My big sister is also married and she has two other kids, a son and a daughter. My second oldest sister is Erin. Um, she's either 28 or 29. I, I don't know. There's so, so many like numbers. I can't keep track of them. Um, she was actually really successful. Um, she went to college and she is now a nurse and she married a firefighter and uh now she has two daughters she has a three-year-old daughter named sky and she just had a baby and she has a little baby and her name is sienna she to me has the storybook life she is married they have a nice house they have two dogs <laughs> They have their two children, and she just did everything right. Yeah, then I have Maggie. Um, she's 17. She's my twin sister, and she's in juvie right now. And that's all I really want to say about her. I just don't even know what to say about her right now. Uh, Robert. He is 15 years old. And um, he is homeschooling. He's also homeschooling, but he's going back to regular school because he decided that he didn't, that he would try not to do his freaking homeschool work. And my mom told him if he doesn't do it, then he's going back to regular school. So now he's going back to regular school and he's going to leave me home alone, completely and utterly home alone with Aaliyah when she's born. So, woohoo. Um, he is a kind and compassionate person. He has a huge heart. He's very sweet and he's caring. He is misunderstood. He's kind of a strange person. He's kind of shy and he's insecure about himself and he's like, I don't know, he's just kind of strange and a lot of people don't really understand him but I think, I think he's pretty cool. And uh, he's very lazy. Does not like to do chores around the house. Does not like to do anything except for sit in his room and do nothing and play video games. And um, he's very quiet. And then there is my mom. My mom works her ass off for us kids. She, her entire, oh my god, there's a spider. Oh, oh. Oh my god, I have to have Robert kill a spider really quick. There. It's on my window. Where did it go? Oh my god, it's in my room somewhere. Oh my god, I can't sleep in here. It was up there. No, it was in my window. Look in the window, see if you find it. Oh my god. I'm gonna have a heart attack. It was over there. What the fuck, man? Can you see it? 
<laughs> yes, it is. It's in here. Oh my god, I can't ever sleep in here ever again. It really pisses me off. I want to fucking kill somebody right now. Stupid fucking spider. Where are you, motherfucker? Ah, I see its reflection in the window. I don't know where it is. Oh, oh my god. Well, there is a rabid spider in my room somewhere, and I'm not ever going in that room ever again until it gets the fuck out of my room. Now I'm pissed off and hormonal because there's a stupid fucking spider in my room, and that fucking pisses me off. Anyways, my mom bases her entire life around her kids. And she, like, every single part, every single aspect of her life is based around us. Everything she does is for us. She's been the biggest support system throughout my whole pregnancy. She's always been there for me. She may say things sometimes that I really don't want to hear and it really pisses me off at the time, but when the whole thing with Maggie and Dallas came around, then she would just be like, oh yeah, well, if it wasn't Maggie, it was going to be somebody else. And it's like, a little sensitivity, please. Like, <laughs> I know. And then like when Dallas was trying to uh, get a hold of me after Maggie went to Juvie, then she was like, oh, whatever. Just because he doesn't have Maggie now, he wants you. And it's like mom like seriously like way to rip my heart out <laughs> so yeah she does say things at some points that really just really hurt <laughs> so I love my mom more than anything like she is the best mom in the whole entire world and I couldn't have asked for anything better I would kill and die for my mom. That is how much I love her. And she is going to be the world's greatest grandma. So, yeah. That's my family. Thanks for watching. Make sure you guys comment, like, subscribe, and request videos. And sorry I'm being really hormonal in this video. Okay, I seriously had to pee really, really bad. And I thought I was going to piss myself. And then I went to the bathroom and I did not even pee that much. That spider is somewhere in my room. What did you see? It was in my window. On my window. And I bet you it's in my, my bed now. And it's going to bite me. And I'm going to get a poison. Owie. And my clothes picked up. Well, it's hard doing things when you're pregnant because my energy is shot. Hmm. Good. Hi. There's my daughter. Yes. Yes, she has stinky butt breath. Why does your breath smell worse than somebody's butt? Huh? I think my farts smell like your breath. And that's weird.